Yo, what's good, my people? Jay Jones in the building. How are you guys? I'm doing great. Yo, so let's go ahead and get straight into it, man. Let's talk about it. AD is now a Laker. Okay, so I was streaming yesterday, right? Shouts to everybody that came through on the stream. I think we had like 40, 45 people. You know what I'm saying? That's love. You still got the Twitch notifications on. I promise I appreciate that. But throughout the stream, everybody was just like, yo, Jay Jones, what you think, man? What you think about the trade? And um, I still don't know how how to feel about it from an OKC standpoint. That ain't really that ain't really what we wanted. I'ma go and keep it a buck. I'ma be the first OKC or to say it. We ain't like that. We ain't like that. The way it was looking, Golden State was gonna have to take a year off. That's the way I'm looking at it. Golden State was just gonna have to take one year off. I believe Clay and KD will both resign, but you know, since the injuries, which which is really bad, they pretty much just have to take one year off. And you know, with that being said, that pretty much just opened the West up for grabs. You know, anybody can pretty much come out on top of the West now. So I'm like, all right, so this gonna give my boy Paul George the chance to really just focus this summer and come out the West with Westbrook. But then I got this notification saying that AD is now headed to the Lakers. <sighs> AD, AD who? Okay, AD, Andre Drummond. Okay, I can live with that. I can live with Andre Drummond going over there, you know what I'm saying? Him and JaVale might clash, you know what I'm saying? What are they going to do with Tyson Chandler now? They didn't really need another center. Who did the Pistons get? Nah. Anthony Davis. Ooh, Anthony Davis, he actually went? Oh, man. Oh, wow. Now what are we going to do? So I'm wondering, like, yo, how did this even happen? You know, Magic couldn't make the deal happen. Like, what, what happened? And then it, it dawned on me. LeBron made the deal. I mean, I guess the conversation went something like this. <laughs> Knew they'd call me. It's LeBron. Hi, LeBron. We're ready to make you a deal. Keep talking. We want Brandon Ingram. Ingram. They talking Ingram. Has he been on the weights? He been taking his protein? He hasn't. Y'all can have Ingram. Two first round picks. Two first round picks. I can do that. What else you want? Josh Hart. <sighs> gotta have Josh Hart. Bronny. Josh Hart. We gotta have Josh Hart. Josh Hart is big for us. We we need Josh Dang. Hart. Wait. They kinda want a lot. They kinda want a lot, bro. What you think I should do? Should I trade him? Yeah. Okay. You ain't trying to get another year, are you? No. See, I thought you was just tricking him. Thought you were tricking him and then you was gonna get one more year with me. I liked the idea at first. Our sons team up and we team up too in LA. Like father like son, LA time. Must be Gabrielle talking. Oh, that cool. Yeah, we can make it happen. We won Lonzo Ball. <sighs> Lonzo. Ball, brother. He does have nice defense. Lonzo? Without Lavardo. Just Lonzo. Hmm. Can you make it happen? Alright, so let me get this straight. Lonzo Ball, two first round picks, Brandon Ingram. And Josh Hart. We want Kuzma. We need Kuzma now. Kuzma? Oh, hell no. Nah. No, nah, you ain't getting Kuzma. Nope. I'll give you another round pick. Three first round picks. Lonzo Ball, Ingram, Josh Hart. And I get AD with the unibrow. Not that other one. He was talking about shaving and I don't want that one. With the unibrow. Yeah, that one. We got a deal. Tell AD is done. So I guess if you like the trade, you got to thank LeBron. And if, if you're against it, you... You got to be mad at him. Do I think that's a lot to give up for Anthony Davis? Yeah, I do. You know what I'm saying? Like each one of those players have their their strengths. They're all still young. You know, just from the outside looking in, I, I just feel like that's that's just a lot of players and a lot of picks for, for one player. But do I understand it at the same time? Yeah, I really do. Just because, again, you know, if you're if you're a Lakers fan, then you kind of know what they're trying to do. Like they're trying to make that one push. You know what I'm saying? Bron is not getting any younger. He's accomplished so much. And uh, they have a really good chance now to come out the West. Like, they have a really, really good chance to come out the West. And, you know, that's tough for me to say because I've been rooting for OKC. But I feel like the Lakers really have a good shot now. They can just find, they have enough money to sign another superstar. If they do that and, like, get, like, Jimmy Butler or something, like, Y'all got some room over there, Lake Show? And then from the Pelican standpoint, if they're trying to rebuild, of course, you're going to get Zion. You can pair that with Lonzo, Brandon Ingram, uh, Josh Hart. And then you get three other round picks as well like yo you i feel like you're kind of setting yourself up pretty nicely for the future i can see how both teams benefited from this 
Uh, this was a big time trade for the Lakers, though. I, I gotta, I gotta admit it, man. I'm glad to see it. I don't mind when. You know what I'm saying? Players want to team up with other great players. If that's what they want to do and they see themselves like building around each other, like I'm all I'm I'm honestly all for that. As a basketball fan, I'm really happy about that. As an OKC fan, I'm salty. I'm salty. I don't like that at all. Because y'all didn't have to do that. And we need we the ones that need help, yo. PG need help out there. You know what I'm saying, Russ? He's a roller coaster. You don't never really know what you're gonna get. He's up and down. So thank you guys for listening to my thoughts. Uh, as always, we can talk about any NBA, anything you guys want to talk about. You know, I'm open to talk about it. Big thank you to everybody who's constantly watching my videos. Those who come through the streams. Like, uh, yesterday's stream was really, really dope, man. I met some cool dudes. Uh, we played 2K. was blowing everybody out. Uh, Rec. Jordan Rec, that is. We, we weren't in the park. Y'all let me know what you guys would like to see on the channel, and uh, we're going to keep it going. Thank you guys for watching. Until next time, it's Jay, and I'm out.